Ewan, uh, what a turnaround. Uh, you must be on cloud nine. Oh, unbelievable. It's my first Bristol Bath game, Derby at the Wreck. No better feeling, really. Um, got the result, got the win. Yeah, over the moon right now, yeah, happy. We spoke in the week and you said you didn't know whether to be nervous, you didn't know whether to be excited, and you were, didn't really know what to expect from the occasion, but it really lived up to it. A, a game of kind of two halves, so to, so to speak, from a Bath perspective. What went wrong in that kind of first period that allowed the Bristol to get on top? Um, I think it was tough. I think they just turned up and they're, they're on fire, if I'm honest. They, they, they turned up with a good attitude that they were going to basically roll over us. Um, I just don't think we were switched on. Um, and we were sticking to our game plan. I think that sort of let us down in that first sort of 20 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes. Yeah, and obviously that changed at half time. Yeah. What was said then to have that turnaround in that second half? Yeah, so like I said this before, um, we sort of said, you know, stick to our game plan. Um, if we stop their, like, their driving threat, you know, stuck to our game plan, stuck to the way we play our systems, we knew we'd have a positive outcome. I think, I think that sort of showed in the end. Yeah, and we had an exciting kind of few moments kind of early in that second half to go, actually, we can get back, ourselves back into that game. And then even though Joe's try was disallowed, we stayed on top and we had the focus to go and get the job done. Yeah, 100%. Like, although well, that try was disallowed, we knew we were on top. We knew we had that sort of pressure on them. I thought we all, we all sort of thought, you know, if we stick to, like we said, stick to our system, stick to our game plan, you know, these positives will come and then we just, like, like I said, got the outcome and, you know, what better feeling to win over Bristol at the wreck. Earlier on in the season, that, that is a game that Bristol may have gone on to kind of win quite handsomely, but like I say, has there been a shift in mentality to be able to then grind out a result like that? Um, yeah, I'd say so. I think we're, just, we're all willing to, you know, dig deep and work hard for each other. I think. That's what that's what how that's how we should be, you know, be one collective and you know, if one if someone one makes a mistake, you know, we bounce back and like I said, we, we showed that with the tries we scored, you know, team tries and yeah, we are we, on sort of cloud nine right now. You know, it wasn't perfect performance but we showed that for the end of the first half, second half that, you know, we can play rugby and stick to our systems we can get the job done. And for you a performance of the match uh, award at the end of uh, end of that, is that one of your favourite bath moments? If I'm honest, I didn't expect it, if I'm honest. Um, no, I just love playing for the playing for the club, playing for the shirt, and you know to see some recognition at the end like that is yeah, it's special. I think my family will be pretty happy as well. Well done, Tom. Thank you very much. Thank you.